All right, Kristen, back to you. You're talking about there's some chances of snow, something light, when, where, what's the deal? Well, it's almost an upside down version of today. Today we started off with snow to the north up to an inch in places, uh, portions of Clarion and Venango, Forest Counties, and rain to the south. And then throughout the second half of the day, we dried out a little. Tomorrow will start off dry, but later in the afternoon it'll be your drive home or your evening plans that could be wet or up to the north white for just about an hour or two. Right now we're looking at drier conditions in Pittsburgh. We're at 51 degrees. The winds are west northwest at 14 miles per hour, and that's interesting because the cold front is starting to approach the area that is going to shift our winds out of the northwest and cool us back down overnight. So temperatures still in the 30s and the 40s over through the laurels and the ridges. Somerset finally has just gotten up to 50 degrees. This warm air has been pushing in from the southwest. We're up to 61 degrees in Morgantown, 54 in Washington, 55 in Wheeling. Now overnight, cooler air will start to move back in from the northwest. You can see already South Bend, Lansing, Toledo starting to drop. So this green area is going to start to shrink again. Look at that. Charleston's at 65 degrees. Meanwhile, Washington, D.C. and Harrisburg are still in the 30s. So overnight tonight, drier, cooler air moves back in. All of the rain we've had, those showers moving through the area tonight as those two systems collided, they're off to the east. Starting out tomorrow morning, it'll be dry, it'll be cool. We'll be in the upper 30s by tomorrow morning. The front will pass through as we go through the morning. So we'll start off the morning, mostly cloudy skies, fairly comfortable temperatures, upper 30s, close to 40 when you wake up. Through the afternoon, things start to change. So by lunchtime, still mostly cloudy, a quiet start to the day. After lunchtime, we start to see showers move in from the southwest. Rain showers really from Pittsburgh to the south by around 3, 4 p.m. Here's the trouble spot. Really along I-80 and just to the south from Indiana to Catanning to Butler, Newcastle, we could see a quick shot of some slushy snow mixing with sleet from around 4 until 6 o'clock before this all changes over to rain and it'll get washed away. But still, possibly even up to a half an inch to an inch of slushy snow, mixing with some sleet north, and then it's all rain tomorrow night. Wednesday morning, we start off dry. It'll be mid to upper 50s Wednesday. Wednesday night, we get one more round of showers that move through and move out of here by Thursday morning, and we still stay mild. So 38, you're low by tomorrow morning. The showers will be ending finally in the next 15 or 20 minutes off to the east. And then here's the seven day forecast. Tomorrow, 46, your afternoon high. Evening, rain and even a little snow up to the north for just a couple of hours. 50s then, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Showers possible late after midnight, New Year's Eve. And then we start a nice cool down. We're back to almost normal temperatures on Monday, the first Monday of January. All right.